Trudeau, Justin Trudeau? Um, that, I just shake my head at that. Okay. Oh, v man who capitalized without virtue on the name of his father. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yes, wow is right. Wow. If he had an ounce of character, he would have never run. I'm not happy about him. Un he had no right. Well, he had a right. He's a citizen. He can run. He didn't earn his name. Not impressed. Why do you say that? Is this specific? Because he, his father was very famous. Sure. And so that put Trudeau at a tremendous advantage with regards to moving into a leadership position in Canada. It's not excusable. You should move ahead on your own merits, especially if you're daring to do something like run a country. It's like, it's too, you, you have a moral duty. If you have the advantage of a name, you have a moral duty to supersede the accomplishments of the person who bore that name and gave it its weight before you dare capitalize on it in the public sphere. And there's, Trudeau did none of that. He, can, he knows how to behave. He knows how to act in public. He had the upbringing for it. Other than that, there's nothing there, not that I can see. And if there was, he wouldn't have run the way he did. He's not, not an impressive person in my estimation. Some strong opinions there, strong yeah, well, beliefs there. When he, he appointed 50% of females to 50% of his cabinet because it was, what did he say? It's, well, because it's 2015. It's like, no, quarter of your elected members of parliament were female. If you would, your job was to pick the most qualified people, period, regardless of their genitalia, because they're leading the country. You pick the most qualified people. Instead, he abdicated his responsibility to make those difficult decisions and then wallpapered it over with a, this casual virtue of, well, I'm going to promote women. It's like, no, you're going to promote competent people, you weasel. No excuse for it. Wow.